505 right now. Two students stabbed at their high school earlier this week continue to recover. And this morning, classmates are going to arrive at that school greeted by messages of support and encouragement. This is Wednesday. Two students stabbed during a large fight in the hallway of Annapolis High School. Several other young people involved in that fight were arrested. WMR News' Megan Knight is outside Annapolis High right now. So, Megan, what is planned for this morning? Well, Christian, there's going to be several local organizations that are going to be coming to Annapolis High School in just a few hours from now. They're going to be showing their support to students here after that fight broke out on Wednesday that sent two kids to the hospital. Now, they plan to stand along the bus entrance here. They'll be waving to students, holding up signs. Again, really just showing that they support and care about them. Among the groups that are planning to come out this morning, the Freedom Fighters, the Caucus of African American Leaders, We Care and Friends, and members of the Annapolis High School PTSA. Now, it was on Wednesday morning that a fight broke out inside the school. Anne Arundel County Police saying that at least one of the students had a knife and two kids were sent to the hospital with non life threatening injuries and one of them is now among the seven students who are being charged in connection to this fight. The school superintendent believes that it all stemmed from arguments that happened over a week ago and outside of school and that this may have been an act of retaliation. Right now all seven of those students are being charged as juveniles but police say that could change as well as uh, more students and possibly even more charges could be brought as this investigation continues. We're live in Annapolis. I'm Megan Knight WMAR 2 News. Megan, thank